Hey, do you want to learn how to take a screenshot with your Aula F75 keyboard? In this video, I'm going to show you how to do it with these two methods. So currently I've got this keyboard here and they did not provide any print screen, a dedicated print screen button. So that's fine. I'm going to show you the first method first. And in order to do it, you need to download the Aula F75 software. I've made another video on it, on how to get it. Now, once you've opened it up, select a key on your keyboard which you want to replace with the print screen. So let's say I'm going to use this F12 button on my keyboard, this F12 key. So just click here and on the bottom, you've got your keyboard keys. Select the F12 and select the print key and then click on the save floppy disk. And it's going to save it to your keyboard. Now on my keyboard, this F12 is now going to act as the print screen button. Great, I can just click on the F12 to get into the snipping mode and then I can drag, click and drag to take a screenshot of that particular part. If I go inside my screenshots, picture screenshots, you can see that this is the image that we just took. With this print screen button, you can also press Windows plus F12, which is now your print screen button in order to take a screenshot directly. So let's say I'm browsing through a website and I want to take a screenshot. I can just press on the Windows plus F12 and that's it. It's going to take the screenshot of that particular page. And you can see here in my screenshots folder, this is the screenshot that we just took. Now the second method is easy. If you do not want to change that F12 to print screen, you can press and hold these three keys together. So Windows plus Shift plus S key. And that way you can again get into the snipping mode and do the same thing. Now one thing that I forgot is maybe you want to reset that key that you just set. F12 to print screen. Now there are two methods again for doing that. You can go over here in software and you can just click on this reset key button and it's going to be reset and the F12 is no longer going to work as the print screen. Just need to click on the save button in order to save it to your keyboard. That's it. Uh, the other method is you can reset the keyboard. So you can just press on this escape button and the function key together for a few seconds. There you go. Lights are going to blink. That means that the keyboard is now set to the factory settings. It's completely reset. These are the two methods of doing it. I hope this video helped solve a problem. If it did, let me know with a like and comment. And on the right hand side, you can find more Aula F75 related tutorials. So see you there and bye for now.